that Necrophobe's ultimate early game is a huge tempo loss for the enemy team. It's like cliffing the guy for 30 seconds. The Hunter and uh, Spirit Breaker is going to make it tough for a rude contest here. And they're going to go in on DJ. They, oh, they charge away at him. It might not be a kill there. They don't have stun. They have a stun. They're going in. The immediate TP support here from Jules. They're going to throw off the stun. That's it. But Mushy. I mean, Mushy. I was just so used to call it Jules. Okay. Oh, DJ gets the range. It gets the first blood. Mushy scores it for his team. Good glimpse. The Alchemist back, and this is why you don't pick Alchemist. Will do much, and with Fnatic having this, oh, they're coming in as well. The Winter Wyvern is here, they're ready for this. Ah, oh, they're gonna see extra bashes though. They get one hit. Is there, oh, is there Reaper Scythe? Nope, they get a bash, but really, is it enough? There is another heal coming in in a short while, and I think, I think he's dead. Yep, he is dead, and hacked, and then the Thunder Strike comes in, traps him in. They have another bash there, but he caught at the end, he heals another round. The Splinter Blast, not enough, and Joel's gonna fall there. His heart stops no. as Black claims his life, and he immediately eats up save his charges. And uh, once again, Cuckoo is about to stun himself. Oh no, DJ, run in there. Nope, stun himself. Could have run in there. If there's a sentry ward, sees the bounty hunter, pretends he didn't see it though. Disruptor runs into Radiant's Cuckoo. It's like, okay, I'm in trouble now. Right now, Mushi. He stun comes out. Yeah, it's gonna land. That's a nice bash over. Well, it bash him over the cliff, though. Radiant's yeah, he says, bash me over the cliff. No, he tried for the luck. Doesn't hit it. But no, the Shadow Feed is here with the haste. With the haste as well. And Cuckoo now getting a corner. That's two kills there for Chris. He just hastes through this higher thing. Gets the pick up. Ohio just running in with the tomato. Uh, with the tomato skills, but not good. Basilius just to control the creep wave. He has been getting pretty much uncontested farm here. 51 last set set to the Shadow Fiends. 55. DJ has pretty much been having a good time. Okay, Ohio. <laughs> finally getting the shackle there. Level 3 shackle nonetheless. Uh, Tower oh, you find it. Mmm. Gonna be tough. Radiant running for it. Ah, fortified. donkey. Bye bye, donkey. $700 worth. That's a bottle as well. We get the sentry ward. They pull him back. He's gotta get punished, but hey. What? Radiant's oh. middle tower is under attack. Iowa? Nope, just forcing a TP Radiant's from Bushy. And another night tower. Denied. So Maneski managing to stem the bleeding here, so to speak, uh, on this lane. And uh, Ohio just farming all the way with that four star armor on him, feeling pretty bold. Oh, the Shadow Fiend getting a kill, my bad. Oh my I forgot about the glimpse, I thought they ran away in time, but Ayo, he's waiting. Oh, Radiant's he scouts him out. Tower is under attack. Scouts out this Doom Ringer, he has a drum first. Bushy, ready to pull someone back. Mm, Joel's gonna get caught out. There has to be a click, and they might glimpse him back. How are they gonna glimpse him back? Trees. I think I have to walk in, right? That's kinetic field. There attack. we go. Just him out. Spin the blast, though. They have the creeps walk in, and as your race, they got this guy in the bag. Poor Jules. You gotta get signed down as well, right? 60 Radiant's seconds on the sidelines. And uh, yeah, he does have buyback. Hey, Black, it's the question. Nope, just gotta be backing off here. The Rod of Atos is done for the Pope. And uh, double damage here for the Shadow Fiend. He'll find Wind Ranger. Oh, the Requiem is gonna be nice, but is it perfect? One more click there. We'll get Ranging Potato. He just stick up. Not enough. The Shackle Shock will tag DJ and Black. But a good kill there. The ultimate was spent. The Wind Ranger act some plays going on, and the Atos goes out, slows him down considerably, can reduce a lot of his greater bash damage as well. Something to note, making on that once again, getting the tags all around the glimpses. Okay, interesting choice. That Vanessky, oh man, that was an insane one. Dropped in there by Ryo, gets pushy, destroyed by his own teammates. They jump onto Black, he doesn't have any agents. They punch him, no. the magical spaghetti trucks in, and now DJ getting punished. Where's the doom, man? Where's the Doom? Looking for the Doom, and there's the Doom on that Wind Ranger, but is it enough? The charge comes on and they fight the Donkey, 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 Donkey. Chain Frost, Jesse Bush spreading a the love there, bounces it over to Ready Potato. Not enough, the Sonic Boom comes across, it goes far, and Ohio gets trapped in the trees. He's in trouble there, he's caught among all the enemy heroes, he picks Doom and dies. That's the play, Ryo charges him down, and then that was not a good play for Fnatic. Clumping up there, not respecting the track, not respecting the Winters. Better go straight in, the Power Shot will fly, takes out the creep wave, once again, here comes Doom. Doom is ready in 3 seconds, would really like to see him Doom something, oh no. Jules, nope, gets his friends to betray each other, and the Splinter Blast as well, the Glyph is there, but oh no, the Shackle don't follow up as well, Mushy in trouble, but the Shackle shot is there, they should get Jules here, will they actually bring him down with the Scythe, nope, this heal him down, they want to save the Scythe uh, for a better time, that's a Doom with a Blink Dagger, though that is going to be very effective.
Oh, she? Radiance Being away this tower, it looks like they will not attack. be contesting this. Uh, the Dyer's focus fire will go into tier one. There is a oh, there's a doom here on Rage Potato. He gets the tower. Oh, there's your Aesop as well. This could be him in the sinker. There he goes. Sidelines. That's a big kill to get, but no. Meanwhile, they get DJ. This is a bigger kill to get. DJ getting caught out. The cow comes in from the back, uses the back entrance, and the Shadow Fiend loses his life as they trade the Wind Ranger over for that Shadow Fiend. This is not the trade you were looking for. Something else like Greaves or maybe the Bats. Oh, Sentry Ward scouts out Vash. Vash knows he's in trouble. Dust scatters him with it. Chain Frost to commit. Yep, there you go. They have sight? No sight. Me. 300 kill score, very very pleasant to the eyes, Ohio, built into that play mail, oh could find Cuckoo, this is huge, runs in there, okay, overcommitment.com, and uh, that might not be the play, why is he standing there? That's 85 seconds, Black comes in there with the steals, easy. Well, custom to stealing as a uh, hard carry play. Jesse Bosch got a track next. Shackle shot. Oh crap. But it's okay. Black gets the kill there. Now the Requiem of Souls is going to leave a big mark. But Black get him a trade on. But Jesse Bosch. Oh no. Can he pull back there? And Black with the triple kill. The Requiem of Souls is pretty much there as a. Uh, just pretty much there as a performance. Not going to be doing that much good. Just a light show for fun. The shots come out, Bounty Hunter buys back into it, fakes the nether strike once again. It's ready, Wind Ranger says, alright, here we go. Fallen. Gotta go in, are we gonna go in? The track comes in, a little bit too late, Shackle shot, Ohio gets flashed to his friend, but is it a good idea though? He has got ice armor, it might not be the best idea. They're gonna power shot this, they they make fanatic commit though. They're all gonna blink away now. Okay, what's happening, Vash? You bought back for this. Bye. They see him. And they pick him off, so ready to prep for the base defense. There's a double damage here for Shadow Fiend. He's gonna walk past that sentry ward. He's gonna walk past the sentry ward. He is tagged up. The Nether Strike will come. They actually go bash him in. And that's your Nether Strike committed there. The Shuriken comes in. They do him up for Raging Nader right away. And that's the fight taken out. And they glimpse him back. And they might actually get that kill there. There's a good curse opportunity. Curse, curse. They curse Black. And they go. They're gonna the pile Black in, but they stun him during the curse. So that is going to re-dedicate most of the curse's damage. Cuckoo, being silenced up. Gonna get slow. He's very lucky that he didn't get caught there. But that bash actually did more harm than good. They didn't fire on black. And now the shackle shot comes in. It latches DJ. They really lost their melee racks. Might not want to overcommit here. One Reaper Scythe, and it could be a good game for them. They're gonna heal them up, and the Satanic going up. They're healing up the life once again. Ohio going that shot there onto that Doombringer. DJ fires a quick shot over. The shackle shot once again. This is gonna be latching the eight toes. Just doing so much hurt here, and uh, still having that Aegis balancing out pretty nice. Splinter Blast, gonna be hurting a lot of fanatics, clumping. The Shiva's got once again, Ohio, dropping very low, the cow comes in, the Shackle Shot will land just forget he locks down the Adumo, and uh, down he goes, the side the lens on the Alchemist, that's no buyback for the guy, he's got 1,900, he's saving a buyback, but he's just getting punished there by Black. The Pope of Pestilence has no mercy for this. DJ, oh no, still has that Satanic to blink forth from Black, looking for a kill there, not enough Mushy. Radiant's bottom Tower set the mechanism attack. ready and looking for a push Radiance up north. Are oh, we gonna find attack. it? The Ohio Doom is ready, the Shiva's God is ready as well. Yeah, and Shackle Shot will come in. It will be a kill here on DJ, maybe. It's only an Aegis, and now they start pounding away at Ohio. They glimpse it back, and now Reggie Potato out of the count. Yeah, and that's the site. 91 seconds, and Potato knows this game is out of the count. Fire goes in, tries to find DJ, doesn't get it. They silence him up, trap him down. Alchemist. <laughs> But just useless in this huge team fight of farm heroes here. Fnatic, stay ahead of the fight, stay ahead of the competition all game round, and Black delivers with his Pope. And uh, in the end, it ends the score 21 to 7. Fnatic take game number three to bring it to match point. Winner of, uh, well, if they win one more game, they will win this BO5 and proceed to.